We consume energy every day to power our homes, our businesses, and for almost every function in our daily lives. Our demands on energy resources have significantly increased over the years, and researchers are warning that this is taking a drastic toll on the environment. In fact, electricity, which is often generated using coal, is the number one cause of carbon dioxide, or CO2 emissions, being released into the air, one of the main culprits behind global warming. Traditional sources of energy are large centralized power plants, primarily on coal, fired plants. These plants produce CO2, NOx emissions, and these emissions obviously lead to global warming, acid rain, and urban smog. Today, many companies in the United States are very wasteful in their manufacturing process. We, w we waste a tremendous amount of uh, materials that go into the landfills across the country. Traditional energy sources are not only wreaking havoc on the environment, but all-time high energy outputs are also causing price hikes in heating and cooling costs, and many Americans are demanding a solution. Power companies are responding to these demands by developing clean, reliable, and energy-efficient technologies to try and solve the crisis. Among the newest of these alternative sources is one called a microturbine system. Similar to a miniature jet engine, it's designed to reduce pollutants and greenhouse gases as well as energy costs. Microturbine technology can provide low emissions to the environment through cleaner combustion burning processes, through the use of no oil or coolants uh, to lubricate the system as would traditional technologies, as well as higher on-site energy efficiency, which will use less of our natural resources. Capstone Turbine Corporation is at the forefront of the distributed energy industry. Its proven microturbine power system is revolutionizing clean generation technology, providing businesses with an energy source that significantly reduces emissions and lowers costs. The first organization of its kind to successfully market commercial microturbine products, Capstone Turbine Corporation, is helping combat the adverse issues affecting the environment here in the United States and abroad. Capstone Turbine is the leading microturbine manufacturer in the world, producing over 4,500 microturbines year to date with 15 million operating hours. Our turbines are deployed worldwide in Asia, Russia, Europe, as well as here in the United States, in California, and New York, mostly in urban areas, providing distributed generation, clean power, reliable power. Here at the Ronald Reagan Presidential Library, we use a microturbine which has natural gas that comes in, burns that natural gas, which is a clean burning fuel and it gives us electricity, hot water, and cold water out. The electricity is used throughout the entire complex up here, and then the hot water and cold water is utilized for the uh, air conditioning systems. The nice thing for us is that the air conditioning, uh, the power that's used to power the air conditioning is a clean burning natural gas, doesn't impact the environment, and it is a very efficient system. Capstone's impact on the environment is clear. According to a recent EPA report, the company's turbine projects have resulted in annual emissions reductions equivalent to planting more than 23,000 acres of forest or removing the emission of more than 15,000 cars. The importance of using renewable energies is to expand our fuel supply or our natural resource supply. Many gases such as methane gas which is emitted from landfills and digesters are underutilized and we can take advantage of producing energy by being able to combust these fuels. Capstone's technology can help reduce the effects of global warming because of our ultra low emissions and our very high efficiencies we can achieve when we capture the heat from the exhaust stream. Whether it's a landfill application, digester application, Walmart or an urban setting, or in a hybrid electric vehicle like a bus in downtown New York, Capstone's products with their high efficiencies and low emissions help reduce the effects of global warming. While alternative green resources are proving to be environmentally friendly, Another major energy and economic challenge, the failing utility grid, may also benefit from the technology. One of the key issues facing our country is the aging utility grid. As the grid ages and we get more and more demand on the grid, we're going to see more blackouts and more brownouts facing our country. When we have blackouts and brownouts, the people that are affected the most are obviously the elderly when you have loss of air conditioning, as well as people stuck in high-rise office buildings without elevator power having to take stairs down. Uh, subways and other key infrastructures and arteries of cities without power. Well, the microturbine solution has allowed us to 
use a different source of energy to power up our air conditioning here on the campus. We're using natural gas and not electricity to drive the microturbines. The microturbines actually create the electricity for us. Uh, so if we have a power outage, um, we're able to use the microturbines to create electricity and power up buildings. And also when we're using them just to run our, the absorption chillers for air conditioning, we're not requiring power to be coming off of the electrical grid from the state of California. Reducing our energy consumption is critical to our future. But today's American corporations are becoming more environmentally conscious than ever before, doing their share to help protect and preserve our planet.